Welcome to BizWire. I'm Neil Jones in Beijing. Earlier this week, China's President Xi Jinping called for an early restart of negotiations for a free trade agreement between China and the six Arab nations of the Gulf Cooperation Council, or GCC. The GCC is a political and economic union of six Arab states that border the Persian Gulf, which are Bahrain, Kuwait, Oman, Qatar, Saudi Arabia, and the United Arab Emirates. All six are oil exporters. Xi made the remarks while meeting King of Bahrain, Sheikh Hamad bin Asa Al Khalifa, at the Great Hall of the People in Beijing. Xi was quoted as saying that China and the GCC are important partners politically and economically. Xi said the two sides should restart China GCC free trade area negotiations at an early date and reach an agreement as soon as possible. Bahrain's king said the friendship between China and the Arab world dates back to several hundred, even several thousand years. The king said the two sides have common values and principles. China's premier, Li Keqiang, also met the king on Monday. The king said he is in China to push for ties between the two countries, the GCC and the whole Arab world. The king did say that Bahrain is committed to developing ties between China and the GCC and will make efforts to establish the free trade area at an early date. In China's Great Hall of the People, the two leaders witnessed the signing of agreements dealing with energy, finance and education. Among the agreements signed was a deal to expand communication in culture and education. China will establish a Confucius Institute in Bahrain and hold a Culture Week with Bahrain which aims to bring the youth of both countries together. China's trade volume with Arab states in 2012 was $222 billion, a 13.5 percent increase from 2011, and looks to expand further this year. In the first half of this year, China imported 65 million tons of crude oil from the region, accounting for 46 percent of all the crude oil Beijing imported in the same period. Li Jintao, China's Vice Minister of Commerce said China is one of the world's biggest oil importers, while the GCC states are the world's largest producers of crude oil, accounting for about 20 percent of the global supply and 40 percent of proven oil reserves. Politics was also discussed, as there is much interest in the Middle East, especially in Syria and Egypt. Director of the Center for Middle East Studies at the China Institute of International Studies, Li Guofu said Bahrain greatly appreciates Beijing's stance of not interfering in Middle East countries' domestic affairs while maintaining order in international relations. Wu Suka, China's envoy to the Middle East, said Bahrain plays a unique role in the cementing of the China GCC relationship. Wu said the two countries both oppose military intervention in the Syrian crisis and are calling for a political solution to the issue. Saudi Arabia and the United Arab Emirates are major export destinations for China, and heads of China and the Arab states set a trade target of $300 billion by 2014. By 2015, 55 percent of energy consumed by China will come from the Gulf region, making a free trade agreement all the more important. You're watching BizWire on Blue Ocean Network. All the stories can be seen on our website, bon.tv backslash biz dash wire. In just a second, we'll continue with more insight into the big picture of China's economy.